If you're looking to create professional animations for your Roblox games, Moon Animator is one of the best tools you can use in Roblox Studio. This free plugin offers an easy to use interface for creating complex animations, allowing you to bring your game to life with smooth character movements and interactions. Let's dive into the steps to get started with Moon Animator and make your animation shine. What? What the fuck? More than 95% of viewers aren't subscribed. So if you find this guide helpful, hit that subscribe button and help the channel grow. To begin using Moon Animator, the first thing you need to do is install the plugin in Roblox Studio. Go to the View tab in Roblox Studio and click on Toolbox, then navigate to the Plugins tab. In the search bar, type in Moon Animator and click on the plugin that appears. Hit the Install button and the plugin will automatically be added to your studio. Once installed, you'll find Moon Animator in the Plugins tab of Roblox Studio. Open it and you'll be greeted with a new interface that will allow you to start animating your models. You'll see several key areas, the timeline, animation controls, and the character model. To start creating an animation, select a model or character you want to animate in the Explorer window. Then, click on the Create New Animation button in the Moon Animator window. You can name your animation and choose the format for it. After this, you'll start animating by selecting different body parts of the character and manipulating them frame by frame in the timeline. The timeline is where you'll set keyframes for your animation. To add a keyframe, simply move the playhead to the desired position, adjust the parts of your character, and then click the Add Keyframe button. The more keyframes you add, the smoother your animation will be. One of the best features of Moon Animator is its ability to preview animations in real time. You can watch your animation play out as you work, making it easier to fine-tune movements and timing. If something doesn't look right, you can go back to any keyframe and adjust it. Additionally, if you want to animate camera movements or other non-character objects, you can do so by creating new animation tracks for these elements. You can animate things like lights, NPCs, or even the entire camera view to create more dynamic scenes. Once you're happy with the animation, you can export it by clicking the Export button in the plugin, which will allow you to save your animation and use it in your Roblox game.